Right, we are... Here, did we do that one? We did that one. You are closer to the end now than you realise. Good, thank God for that. I was going to say, we have the powers. It can't be... It can't be that much further. We've done all the temple exploring. There was something I picked up in here first, wasn't there? There was that, which we take. Um, maybe there wasn't. Maybe there wasn't anything else. We save. We do the thing. Unlock the room. What is unity? People are necessary. Myself. Embracing compassion. We're through. And that time we're fine. I'll loot the stuff first. No, I won't. I'll just, I'll just come and get this right now. Save. Now they've opened the damn door. A few hours in yet? I don't know what the correct answer is. I might never. Increasingly, though, I am comfortable with not knowing. The more I reflect on being here in this world, in this time, the more I think it is precisely where I need to be. This time will be different. It won't be about me, so I won't have to run. I can actually build something with intent instead of scrambling to fix something that others create in my name. It can be something beneficial. I can be something beneficial. I'm leaving behind that other person. This world has no place for him. Let him die. Let me live to enlighten the blessed universe before me. You have found the end of my journey, but to know everything, you must find its beginning. On Hyla 2, the island hides the scorpion, and the scorpion's sting hides the truth. It's getting weird now. I like the sack of stuff there. An authentic manifold. I haven't done any crafting whatsoever. Ooh! A tracker's primer. Increases ballistic weapon damage by 5%. I don't know if I've been picking up all those magazines. I do. I am aware that you need to pick them up because they are like skill boosts and stuff. But I might have inadvertently walked past some thinking it was just clutter on a desk. Which is not far from what it looks like. And there's so much other clutter, it's easy to miss stuff. Right, Barrett, we're leaving. Before the game crashes again. Can I fast travel? Well, I, I can't fast travel for whatever reason, so we'll just run it. It's not this boring before the end, thankfully. I'm glad to hear that. Uh, a little Jawa grab? Hi, well, is this worth playing? Uh, it's highly debatable. There is so much boring stuff in it. Um, it gets in the way of the good stuff. Like today, I spent three hours and uh, getting some powers from temples where there is just nothing to do except you, you, you travel to them, you walk into them, you float around, you get a power. And I've repeated that, I think, eight times today. And we're just traveling in between. And that's like one of the that's kind of one of the most important aspects of the game to get as far as I can tell. Oh, I'm encumbered. Again. Yeah, there's this this is an issue as well. What am I I am carrying too much. I can probably spend it to the uh send it to the ship from here actually. The black graviplas helmet. Can I not Oh, I'm just going to drop the damn thing and that. And there's a spacesuit. Actually, that spacesuit's quite nice. So I would like to keep hold of that. We have a pack. I'm going to store it in the spaceship's hold. We're nearly there anyway. Looks like I'm going to kill this thing on my way past. There. That sort of thing is fun. And I like doing that. And I like the combat. It's been a while since I've been in a big fight though. Hey, Wickrack, you definitely won't replay it. I'm going to see what it's like after it's had some more patches, fixes, and see what else they do with it. Because I'm sure they're going to improve it. I think we upset somebody. Did we upset them? No, no, they're fine. But there's like too much boring stuff in between the good stuff. And it's too slow to get to the good stuff. So there's a lot of things that they could have done a lot better. And just simple quality of life stuff, like giving you a map for cities so you can find your, your shops and things 
as you as you wish to travel around. Um, it's not the worst game in the world, but I've been played with crashes as well. I'm playing this on PC through the Game Pass for PC app, and uh, I, it, it crashes a lot. I think I've had three today. I think I had five or six on the last stream I did. So it uh, it goes on quite a bit. And space travel is is basically this. We can't go all the way there, so we're going to go to this one. So we jump to one, and then from another menu we jump to the next, and then from another menu we land on the planet. And that is that is basically it. I'll scan this on my way past. We're going to Hyla 2, which should be that one there. So we jump there. Oh, we're going to see a bit of action actually here. We're going to see the engines rev up. Normally we don't see this because I don't normally jump from this sort of position. Oh, I haven't actually got anything in the grav drives. I will drop the engines down and put the grav drives up one. So, I don't know. I feel like I'm probably punishing myself, forcing myself to play it to the end rather than doing it because I'm enjoying it. Hopefully there'll be some more combat soon. The combat side is, is a lot more entertaining. Although it's got its problems too, but it's still more entertaining. Right, we're looking for some ancient ruins. And there we go, that's how we land. So if you've never played this, if you're looking for a space game, if you want the combat side of a space game, get the Mass Effect series. From Mass Effect 1, 2, 3, I think it's still good. Uh, they'll be on, they'll be cheap on sale. They've got better science fiction combat. If you want the space flight and exploration, get No Man's Sky. If you want a pure space flight game, the hell is that in front of me? Uh, get Elite Dangerous. They all do their own aspects of this a lot better than this does. Okay, it looks like we might be in for a fight here. The hell is this? And save often is my other tip. It doesn't look friendly, but it's not highlighting as something dangerous. Eh? It looks like it should be dangerous. Ah, uh, they're Those fine. Those are starborn ruins. You see that, right? We have to get a close-up of that statue. Wow. You can, like, explore and scan and survey planets and stuff, but uh, I've not had any need to whatsoever. How long have we been playing this for? It's got to be, like, 30 hours, I think I've put in so far. Wouldn't surprise me if these things turned hostile when I enter these ruins. The Scorpion Sting, it's called. And these things look like they could be... Well, I don't know. This is a star chart. Okay. Oh, am I encumbered again? Hang on, how am I... Did I not draw... Oh, I didn't put the stuff in the ship, did I? Idiot. Right, so... Am I supposed to scan this, maybe? Uh, find the scorpion sting on Hyla 2. Okay. This? Do I scan this? No, that's just showing resources. Am I supposed to do anything with this? Am I supposed to use one of my powers here? Yeah, I can dump some gear on Barrett, but I'll forget he's got it, and then I won't get it back when I switch characters. Um, I'll put it in the ship's hold. It's only that spacesuit. That's all I need. Let me have a look at the powers. There might be another power I can use here. There's the... Sense Star stuff. Well, actually, yeah, let's just have a quick go at that. I don't think this is going to be it, but... Indeed it wasn't. Unless there's something to look at round the back. And there's another power. Which was... Oh, shit. I pressed the wrong one. Um, there's another one which was... Not that. Precognition. There. Bend time and glimpse the future. Seeing the path someone will walk and the words they may say. This one might be relevant to this. Good. 
<laughs> oh, maybe not. Okay. I thought we come here. We point at this. And we press the button. And it's currently recharging. Okay. Looks more like a constellation. It does, doesn't it? That thing on there. I wonder if there's something we can interact with on this, though. Well, that clearly doesn't do what I thought it might here. So, there's nothing to do over here, is there? All right, let me just change the uh, power back over to... We'll go for the running one. The hell was it? Personal atmosphere. And let's take a look at the quest and see what it actually says. So, Unity. Find the scorpion sting. The island hides the scorpion and the scorpion sting hides the truth. Right. Just going to have a look around the back of this place just in case. Is this anything? This is nothing, is it? I hope it's not implying that I have to look at a star map and try and line that up. There's nothing to click on to interact with. Although it feels like there should be. Oh, there is something. Okay. This damn thing. Right, so I need to activate this. Um... Barrett, are you stood in the way? Okay, this moves it. I don't think I want to go that way. I'm guessing I have to go and line up one of these. Barrett, you are really right in the sodding way there. There we go. <laughs> I just had to get it to touch the end of that. Go to the last star of the Scorpius constellation. Is that giving us a new objective then? I guess it has. Ah, oh, I'm travelling. I can't fast travel, right? I don't need the money. Let's go to the expansive spacesuit and drop it. Where's drop? Ah. Uh, I really need to get the inventory sorted out. It's so annoying. And drop that. There we go. I have a bit of carrying capacity now. Uh, let's have a look. Let's go. Let's stow our stuff fast and get out. Yeah, let's. I agree. Let's look at the map. Let's take a look at the next place. Is it going to show me? So, so the Scorpius constellation. Uh, is it not going to show me? Okay, set course. It's going there. It's going to Oberon Prime. I need something a bit more interesting. Yeah, this this might be a problem. Time for round two. Keeper Aquila sent me to find the true meaning of unity. Now it's all starting to make sense. You should come aboard. There's another starborn here who is very interested in meeting you. I can speak for myself. Constellation ship, you weren't invited to this meeting, but much of our conversation has been about you. It's only fitting you should join us. I will personally guarantee your safety as long as you come in peace. Be more interesting in fighting. You're one shot at getting those answers you must desperately want. Uh, okay. 
Fine, I'll begin the docking procedure. He's got an evil voice though, so he must be a bad guy. Transmission terminated. So first thing I need to do is just change my power to the... Um, I might sense the star stuff one if this turns nasty. I'll take the solar flare. If someone's hiding, I'll be able to find them with a bolt of plasma. And I think it's time to save the game before something really bad happens. Although it should have auto-saved as we, as we loaded in here. Okay, quick save. Has it quick saved? It has. And we want board. So we've got two starborn. I know nothing about this. But my first option, as always, is to explore the ship and loot the place. There must be something on this. No? There, there literally isn't. Although they do look like doors that can be opened, but not by me. Hello. Again. <laughs> do you remember the Emissary, perhaps? And their ship? The Helix. I believe they ambushed you above Neon and demanded that artifact you worked so hard to gain. Thank you for the stellar introduction. Your success is unprecedented. Before you came, we were just discussing how continued use of force against you is unwise. Damn right. <laughs> there it is. Damn right it is. <laughs> I don't think your patient counselor act is working on them. We are not a monolithic people. The Starborn are individuals. Some are united in cause. Others are in it for themselves. We are all in it for ourselves. Some of us are just more honest. The Emissary threatened your ship, demanded you hand over your artifact. How is that so different from what I did? We needed to warn you off. Every encounter with one of our kind could spell disaster. It has, for them. For whom, exactly? I say whoever can collect them should. You're talking in circles. I came to learn about the unity. Yes. Let's talk about what really matters. The unity. You are on the path to it. It is a place. A gateway. It is where we were reborn. You've really come Holy a shit. long way since the Welcome to Constellation speech, haven't you? Uh, this is some kind of cruel trick. Stay silent. I'm not who you think I am. This universe is only the first one you've been to. I've seen hundreds. Where I came from, I was the one who stayed at the lodge to protect the artifacts. You died on board the Eye while we held off the hunter. One of me, at least. Okay. I collected the remaining artifacts, and they opened the way to the center of my universe, and the doorway to an infinite number of others. The old parallel universe that story. Is unity. When I stepped into it, I became a starborn. It's how I've entered other worlds, including yours. Hmm. I need to see this for myself. And that's the problem. All the artifacts are needed to complete the armillary and open the way to the unity. In every universe, the Starborn fight over them. Innocent people die. You've witnessed the power granted by the temples. The anarchy that can be unleashed. Someone has to decide who should get them. Here it comes. The emissary tells you only the worthy should enter heaven. You're twisting what I mean. They're hypocrites. 
They used the chaos caused by the hunt for the artifacts to establish an order where they decide who's worthy. I'm liking him. I attacked your lodge because I wanted the artifacts, and you held me off. You got away. That wasn't some morality play. You didn't survive because of righteousness. You won <laughs> because of persistence, luck, and skill. Luck, luck had nothing to do with it. As I have done countless times. I was also human once. But what does it matter who or what I was when eternity is within your grasp? Oh, is that supposed to be Keeper Aquilus? I didn't recognize him without his underpants on his head. Uh, let's have a look. You've been to the Unity multiple times. What does that mean? It means I've seen thousands of universes, collected their artifacts, been to their temples. You have a small taste of their power, but it keeps going. Oh, God. Is this how this ties in with New Game Plus? Basically, the idea is that you collect the artifacts from this playthrough and start a game as New Game Plus, but what you've actually done is gone through into another universe, but you've made, you kept the powers and stuff you've built up in this one. Is that how it all ties in? So it just goes on and on and on. And what you're doing is you're not starting the game again, you are going to another universe and playing a different universe but with the same people in it. It's just a parallel one. And levelling up um, your powers. You're, you're basically an inter... What, what, the interdimensional traveller or something? Uh, okay. Right. I did know that you, you kept your powers in... Or, or you level up your powers in New Game Plus, but... Um, I was wondering how they were going to tie things in. And people said the idea is to do play through it first and finish it and then play it through it the second time. I think, well, why? Why is that a thing? Now I know. Now it makes sense. Um, I don't know whether I like that. <sighs> okay, let's see how it goes anyway. Um, I am nothing like you. You mean yet? Go through the unity a thousand times and you'll gain a better perspective. I have hopes for you. Higher hopes than the other members of Constellation. They all end up like the Emissary. You've never come this far. Not in all the universes I've seen. The path to the Unity is opening to you. You're going to tip the scales one way or another. Better your hand be on one of our sides. Do I have to decide now? I'm not helping someone who murdered my friend. Don't you understand what we're talking about? There's an infinite number of your friend out there in the multiverse. One is right over there. Besides, why fight me again when you don't have to? I want a truce between all three of us. Give you some time to think over which approach to the unity is the one you want. Mine or the Hunter's. Yes. Let's see how willing you are to live under <laughs> someone else's rules. Okay. Just remember, one of us isn't trying to judge you. I mean, the, the I've already decided the path I'm going to take, I think, without even talking to them. I'm the, the end goal is to kill them both and take their stuff. That's that's the one we want. You like it more if you could take all your stuff with you, you keep skills and powers and get a suit and shit, but money guns nope. Oh, you keep skills. Okay, I thought they might have reset. But if you keep skills, that's actually... That's a reason to power through the game and finish it and start it again, I guess. Because then you've already got those baseline skills and you can start levelling up all the other stuff that you need. I see. I thought it looked like a hell of a grind to get all the skill points levelled up. I can see why now. So it's all designed about playing through and then starting New Game Plus afterwards. Whereas I see as New Game Plus things, they should be an option to play. And they should be like, just a way of doing things different, but a reward for having completed it once. Not an integral way of playing the game. Let's talk to uh, this emissary. guy. You might think the Emissary is on your side. But your persistence is what forced them to tell you the truth. Remember that. After you attacked the Lodge, you let me go. Why? 
to see what would happen, of course. You might not understand just how many times I've done this. Usually, you're the one who ends up dead, and whoever cries over your body goes on to become the emissary. Usually. Sometimes I manage to get you all bunched up and take care of the problem in one go. And sometimes the emissary has gotten to me first, and I never arrive. Hundreds and hundreds of variations of me, packing through Constellation. And it's almost never you. You making it to your ship on your own. That's new. Okay. I took it as a sign. I don't get many of those anymore. They're not super easy to kill, I bet, and I would hope not as well. Ah. Uh, so it doesn't. Oh, but it's so silly. If you were to go into the different universes and see more or less the same things so many times, why would you follow the exact same path every time meeting the exact same people to do the exact same things? Would you not use the opportunity to do something different? It's just like Groundhog Day otherwise. Or what's the other thing? Um, Battlestar, where it's like all this has happened before and all this will happen again. I don't have a whole lot of time for these things in science fiction and that and time travel, which really, really annoys me when they use time travel as a... Or, they use time travel or as or this multi-universe thing as a reason for everything you've just seen um, hasn't actually happened. We've just undone it all. So, death to them all, I'd say. Um, what is the unity to you? Why kill for it? Whoever created the artifacts and built those temples is playing a game with us. One whose prize is access to the center of all creation. There are no rules. Whoever gets all the pieces wins. And I've won. Over and over. Not this time, pal. I don't kill for the unity. I find the easiest pathway to it. Interesting. Any thoughts for tomorrow's stream, Christy? I won't be streaming tomorrow. Um, I, uh, Wednesday's not supposed to be one of my dreams. As it turns out, tomorrow I've got dreams, streams even. I've got a load of work on. So I'll be back Thursday, Friday this week, though. And um, I still have to decide. I need to look at the poll results and see what people have picked and see which is the most uh, popular option. It's it could be the 40k Rogue Trader game, but we'll we'll have a look. Okay, you had this meeting because of me. <laughs> no, we always end up having this meeting at this time. But it's the usual affair. Can we make peace? No. Oh, how tragic. Honestly, I was beginning to wonder why I kept tending. And it's bad habit I started a long time ago. Perhaps I just like meeting the emissary to gloat. <laughs> but you have provided something quite new to talk about. Maybe hmm. you're a random die roll. Or maybe the unity is finally responding to all <laughs> my hard work. I feel more like a random sausage roll than a random die roll. Too much Christmas... Cheer. Uh, let's have a look. You called the emissary a hypocrite. Why? They enter the unity, take artifacts from others, employ force. All the things I do. I am many things, but I would never tell anyone what to do with their gifts. That is your decision, not someone else's. I'm trying to look at the reflection in his helmet. The it... emissary wants to become the judge of who gets to enter. But the unity itself doesn't judge. I think it's a reflection of my character's... You can see the lower legs and maybe the body, but it looks in the position where he'd have, like, eyes. Like, narrow, wide eyes. You see the reflection there? You can see it there quite nicely as it, as it tilts up and down. It keeps drawing my attention. Right, and why did you attack us? I've simply found that it's the quickest way. Talking, forming alliances waiting for the right moment to commit theft. It's all so tiresome. 
time admit you getting away has been the most interesting thing to happen in quite some time. As soon as I realized what had happened, I knew I needed to wait until this meeting with the emissary to decide what to do about you. Oh, okay. I thought that would all lead to something. That was just um, I know we are not the interesting, same we met in I our guess. Hi, Jaquel. Such an interesting decision to make when the time comes. Again. I'll tell you everything I can. Uh, so you try to protect the artifacts, keep them from being abused. You've seen the terror the hunter causes. Every time a starborn goes through the unity, they get more artifacts, find more temples, gain more power. We can't let more like him abuse these gifts to destroy whatever's in their way. But that's exactly what I've been doing. What exactly is the armillary? When all the artifacts are assembled, the device they create is called the armillary. In many ways, it's a model of the multiverse itself. Through it, you can reach the unity. And from there, you can become Starborn. In your gameplay, Barrett was the one who died, not Sarah, so it's weird seeing her to be the emissary. It's nice that you get some different outcomes from uh, from different playthroughs. Okay, I've I've had enough of this shit. Um Do we go back to the ship? Is there anything to, to do? The pilot seat. I'm gonna You're not authorized to pilot this ship. No, I bet I'm bloody not. Right, do we leave? Before you leave, I want to give you something. A way to another artifact but also a lesson in how dangerous they can be. Seek the moon of old earth. There are secrets there you must discover for yourself. Here, to open the way. Hmm. You starborn sure like you must see for yourself nonsense. I do not always know if you are a person I should be helping. Forgive me. I have also found that advice is a poor substitute for experience. I ask you again, go to Earth's moon. You should also talk to your colleagues in Constellation. I am sure they have gathered more information on the remaining artifacts in the fringes of space. Part of me wonders what they will all say about what you have learned. But I will leave that to you. If I am honest, the last thing I want to do is go and talk to my colleagues about this. Okay, I guess we're leaving. Your reveal was the romance choice? What? I haven't looked down romance options in this at all. Glad to see you're back in one piece. Yes, yeah, so am I. Thank you very much. Very kind of you to say so. Let's pick a skill, but I don't think I've got anything unlocked that I, I wanted at the moment. So we still can't do the medicine to get the weapon engineering. So I feel like this is not so important now, knowing that the idea is to to like play the game again to get all the, all the good skills that you want. The spaceship stuff, I can't do the boost pack thing anyway. I can't do the piloting because I need to destroy more ships. Maybe I should do some um, ballistic and energy weapon stuff. We could unlock those. Although I am trying to avoid space combat in general because um, it's not great. Or I'm not enjoying it as much at the moment. If I had a better ship, and it's not a bad ship I've got, but if I had a better one, I'd probably enjoy it more. So I could do, because this is a pain in the ass. I'm going to, stealth is also good. I'm going to take the weightlifting one. I'm just, I've been meaning to do this since level one. We're now level 27. And yay, I can carry 10 kilograms extra. But when it says increase things by 25 kilograms, I think that means it's only 15 more than I've got now. Because I think it's 25 over base, not 10 over base, then an extra 25 over base, then an extra 50. Because this is getting, like, heavy by this point. We can test that out, can't we? Is that how this works? All right, see you later, Duke. Thanks for uh, hanging out today. It's been awesome having you. We'll catch you on Thursday. I'll be back on Thursday. Uh, let's have a look.
I can go up to 155. So it's gone from 145 to 155. We'll see how the next one affects that. But I suspect it's not. Oh, wait, I've got a skill point. I've still got a skill point. Did I not confirm that? I maybe didn't confirm that, did I? Complete the previous rank challenge. Sprint for a thousand meters while at 75% or more of your maximum load capacity. Easy. Oh, so easy. Right, I'm going to save that skill point and then we're going to do that straight away. Uh, let's have a look. So we're going for... There's Unearthed. Go to the Nova Galactic Research Station and there's Final Glimpses. Return to the Lodge. Uh, we're going to go to this one. And it is right here. Can I... An unexplored route. God damn it. Well, that means is that it's too far. Or is it? Can I not just set me to the... Ah, where's the sodding? Where am I at in this? Hang on a second. I'm there. Can I not go just to Sol? I can go to Sol. Okay. Why was it saying unexplored route? We're going to moon. Set course. Jump. Okay, I have no idea why it was saying that before. Have I been to NASA yet? On Earth? No. Is that a thing? Oh wait, no, hang on. There's a there's a moon landing and you pick up something from it as like a little memento. I, I I've been to that. If that's what you, that's the one you mean. Right, let's see what we've got here. We have... We have what? Come on, Barrett, you're with me. Oh, I need to do this sprinty thing, don't I? Oh, I need to change my powers over in that case. We'll go with the uh, personal atmosphere. Yep, we're just going to be always constant on sprint. In fact, I might just run around in circles to get this weightlifting thing done. Nova Galactic Research Station. So this one's a new one on me. Is there anything in here we can have? Nope. Thousand meters. How many laps around the base do you think a thousand meters is? It should say when I've leveled it up. There you go. 250 so far. Okay, that's that's a long way to go. When did I pick up the extra skill point then that I forgot to spend? Or did I get two for doing something? Oh, I may as well have the stuff. All right, see you later, Smegly. Thanks for uh, dropping by today. Mm, I'm tempted just to go in this place, actually. I guess we'll pick up that sprinty thing at some other time. What's that? Rope? Well, we're halfway there, so that's good anything on here. There might be something on the roof. Or there might not. Right, okay. So where's the way in? There's that little sad dot. See something in there. Oh, hang on. Here we go. The moon base key.
Is this something that we could have found earlier? Just by exploring, but obviously not got into it. Hmm. I guess we go use the computer that's still running after all these years. After we loot the place, obviously. A snack pack protein bar. What does that say? Mondays, am I right? Heal gel, I will take that. And the wine. Don't think I want distilled water. Looks like everybody evacuated fast. All right, let's have a play on the computer then. So Voltaire. I want to remind the research team that Voltaire is a highly proprietary supercomputer that is currently being contracted exclusively for use in Project Prism. It is not meant for your own personal projects. Yes, it's amusing to see just how many decimal points of PI it can calculate. Of Pi, sorry. How many bits of encryption it can brute force. Or whether you can simulate table tennis with a perfect aerodynamic simulation. But there'll be time for that later. For now, I need everyone concentrating on hitting our deadline. We're developing exciting new aerospace technology with our partner and client. What could be that should be more than enough to keep anyone from being bored project prism launch play the recording on the roof why is the recording on the roof we're happy to announce that the first test launch of project prism will be held today i would like everyone to suit up and join us on the roof okay i guess i should have come in here first rather than exploring is there anything here though Home relay. Oh, hang on. There must be. There must be. Cred stick. I'll take those. What is that? Is that a big space suit? Nope. Uh, what's that one? A vial. There is some junk lying around this place, isn't there? They bought it tons of extra stuff on without consideration for whether it was fun or not. What in here? Just just everywhere, I think. This game has got loads of stuff stuck to it. Not just the clutter, but um I mean there's been an awful amount of work gone into developing certain things and putting things in the game. But like you say, without people actually thinking, should we put this in the game? The hell is that? That looks um a science crate. No digipics? Oh, you are kidding. When did I run out of digipics? I bet they got confiscated when I got arrested because I might have had some stolen ones with me. That's annoying. Nothing of any use there. Okay. I guess we leave this place then. Unless there's a digipix in that, that locker there. What's the chances? Zero. I need to go and find a vendor. I need to buy some of those. I hate leaving chests and stuff. You know, behind. It's, it's awful. Right, so we're going up on the roof. Science at a time, Canaveral. Counting down in five, four, three, two, one. I feel like this would be better Are you reading? as a video. Clear, Nova. Indicators look good. 
The ship should be cruising Jupiter's orbit right now. Visual confirmation will be possible in... <laughs> 32 minutes. Afraid the speed of light is on the slow side these days. <laughs> How does it feel to break the laws of physics, Calaveral? We're all pretty excited down here in NASA, I won't lie. Excited enough to tell me where you got the original data? Not in a million years, Nova. Go to NASA? Okay, we're going to NASA. This was a... <laughs> Travel all the way here to see a moon base to listen to a bloody recording. I mean, they couldn't even put a cutscene in for us. It can't even be a video recording. I mean, Jesus Christ. Who makes voice recordings anymore? They're all video blogs and selfie blogs and stuff. There's no one does a voice recording. Apart from me, maybe, because I'm ancient and a dinosaur. Look at this place. Home. Right, now we are going to the next one. Are we not on that button? We're not. Coming out. We are going to... Earth, I'm guessing. Oh yeah, Earth doesn't look like it does anymore, does it? Yeah, I, did, I didn't think this was Earth. Is that actual Central America? Yep, Cape Canaveral or Cape Kennedy? Wait, can I just click on that, actually? Just put no. No. Click on that one. Yes. Okay, I'll click yes. And we'll travel there. I was hoping just to land straight away. Right. Let's... Oh, I've scanned this already, haven't I? Apparently not. The NASA launch tower. That doesn't look like it did from space. We could see the outline of North America from space. We can't see it there after we've scanned it. We've got a notepad and pencil on the desk. This is how high-tech I am. That is currently the script and notes and review plan I have for this game. <laughs> it's just scribblings on a bit of scrap paper that I have by the desk. I have all this technology where I could do this electronically and I, I resort to paper, because paper doesn't crash on you. Uh, let's have a look. We need to exit the ship. Oh, nice. There's a big thing there. I have been to... Um, which one is it? The Kennedy Space Center. And it is, it is an amazing place. If you get a chance to see it, if you're in Florida, go and, go and visit it. It's one of those places that it is, it's just inspirational to think that um, humanity, when it works towards a goal, can achieve such things. But we see the size of uh, the ships and the rockets and the shuttles. It is just absolutely amazing. Especially when you see the Saturn V hanging up in the, in the big sheds. You walk underneath it and you see that it looks, parts of it look like it's held together with duct tape and stuff. And you think they really went into space strapped onto that yeah it's true that Halloween paper and pencil is usually a lot faster than the technology approach yeah I never when I sat down to write a note on a piece of paper had to wait for the note to update itself before I could start writing on it for example and I didn't have to save the work afterwards once I did the work it was automatically saved it was amazing Yeah, this is why I don't play post-apocalyptic games very often. Because the thought of our planet ending up like this, I find is quite sad. I mean, it will one day. It is inevitable, but I won't be around to see it. Well, hopefully we'll be around to see it. I'm not planning on it going like this in the next 50 years. Where's the way up? U.S. National Air and Space Museums are supposed to be good too. You've only been to Kennedy though. Yeah, it is great. It is great. 
Uh, when you see the thing that trundles out the massive platform on tracks that holds the rockets up to launch them and positions them, and you look at the size of it, uh, it's, it's really, everything's good there. They've even, even down to the alarm system they've got that when they're going to have a lift off, they make this, this, this these, these alarms go off to scare all the wildlife out of the area. Because the place is teeming with alligators and stuff. So as few things get hurt in the blast as possible. I, I think that's just, just cool. Even back here, look, we've still got the ubiquitous chest. A NASA notebook. Power's still on. Yeah, I know. It's amazing, isn't it? There must be some really okay. good solar panels working somewhere. It's too cold. My fingers can barely bend. Uh, where, am I, where am I going? There must be a stair up somewhere. Maybe what we'll do... Did they just turn more lights on for me? Let's have the scanner. Don't think I'm supposed to read any of that. No direct path seen. Okay, so maybe we need to figure this out. This was where I came up, right? Unless I'm supposed to go up the outside. What's the gravity like? I uh, don't think that's the answer. Okay, so it's pointing up there. I don't have a jet booster to get up there, so that can't be the it. It can't it just can't be it. Hang on. It's gotta be somewhere else. Yep, I guess the atmosphere went and then the water went. Or the other way around, I'm not sure. Is that anything? Oh, this this could be it here. That's it, but I'm on a very precarious edge. A little bit too precarious, as it turns out. I want to be going that way. No, I don't. My jetpack is is shit. Right, so I want to get to... I think I was right where I got to, actually. Hang on. Why can't I get up there? Right, I'm going to let that recharge. Unless I'm missing something. Oh wait, some stair is that a ladder over there that I can jump onto? It looks like it's on the outside of the building though. Uh well I got up this bit, so let me just try it again. Unless I can jump onto that bit there. That's possible? No, okay. Oh, okay, well, um I can't do the little jump, but I did the big one. I don't know quite how that works, but I'll take it. <laughs> Barrett failed. Oh no, wait, how, how did you get up? Was there an easy way escape. up that I didn't see? Well, they realized it was over. Oh, maybe they maybe came that way, who knows? I don't actually know where I'm going here. This looks like it's designed to go around here. And up there. Okay, it looks like we're just going up there. I'm getting um, Far Cry vibes from this, from climbing towers. Well and truly deserted. Really looks like this one almost made it to launch. Find a way inside. Power required. Oh, you scumbag. Right, that looks like power, right? Okay, what's in here then? 
distilled water and coolant. Oh, is this going to be it? Ah, I need a power cell. Okay, we've done... Oh, these are power cells. We've done this before. I'm going to take that with us because it, it feels like there's going to be something testing me somewhere. Right, do we have juice now? Turn that off. Watch, I've gone the wrong way and taken the lift down to the bottom. We'll have to run all the way back up. Uh, let me see. Crew preparation area. I can't imagine how tense and chaotic it must have been. What was that big rumble? Right, okay, so launch procedures. Final vitals and suit checks are essentially we've come a long way as far as tolerances. Yes, and shit. Well, shit. It's half eight. That should that should be where we stop the stream, actually. Half eight, half six. Oh my god. I just want to see where the last save is. It, if we're lucky, it might be just as we come in there. What's that, four, five crashes today? Four anyway, isn't it? I'm sure it's four. We had one uh, about an hour into the stream, then two in quick succession. Am I having fun yet? If it wasn't for you guys to talk to, I wouldn't have enjoyed any of today's stuff. Hang on, there was, was there some combat? We've killed about four or five starborn guardians and a thing that looked like what was it a toad mouth a, a hunting toad mouth or something is that the only fighting we've done today we haven't had any proper fights have we 629 it's luckily it is right just there that's an auto save i'm going to load it in so i can quick save it as well and then i'm off to go and recharge my sanity because this game is sorely sorely testing me do you guys want to see me finish it? We'll finish it this week if you do. I'm sure we'll get it finished. But by God, this is... It is right here, so that that is okay. 